we await, as we wait for the world of football to return, I've decided to go back in time to take a little look back at the football shirts from the past, ranking them from hit to shit. And in today's video, we're taking a little look at Swansea. Right, folks, back once again with another video. Today, we're taking a look back at, of course, some football shirts from the past and ranking them from hit to shit, of course. Which one, of course, from your club's era uh, uh, are ranked highest, in my personal opinion? That's, of course, what this video is all about, and we'll get into it in just a second. Of course, if you're new, where you've been, smash your subscribe button back to all things Rovers related, of course, uh, championship related, world football related. We're going to all hear boys under one roof. Yeah, so I'm going to go back to as many shirts as we can, stretching from now. So if if your, if your club has released its shirt for the 2023-2024 season, we'll put that in the mix. We're going to go all the way back to the Premier League era, which of course was the start of the 1992-1993 campaign. So all the shirts from now to then, rang them from hit to shit. So let's get into it. But of course, if you're new, smash your subscribe. Of course, appreciate any support. Uh, of course, big shout out to the Patreons as well. But anyway, let's get into it. All right then, folks, today we're going to take a look at Swansea City. That's right. Hopefully, hopefully I have all the shirts uh, from the present day all the way through, uh, all the way back to when football began. And that's, of course, the 992-993 season. That's when the Premier League started. That's when the football began, guys. You know it is. You know it's true. Uh, we may come across shirts that have been uh, used in multiple seasons and we may or may, may not have missed a shirt or two. Let me know if I've missed one, uh, but realistically, we got the pretty much them all here. So we're going to jump in the deep end uh, and turn the clocks back to whenever. Uh, we're going to start with actually 1999 here with Swansea and have a little look at this Badgerino. Pretty simple stuff uh, on this one. And I actually, I think we started off with an okay shirt. I'm just trying to find, it was a uh, old school division three shirt, this Badger. Like the logo, logo's cute, quaint, motorcycle, motorcycles and cycles. I think it's cute. New balance. Uh, it is simple. It's plain. And I think it's a good way to start off right smack dab in the middle. Now, I'm trying to have a quick overview of the Swansea shirt. I'm actually going to probably put this as a B. I think this is a good, this is a good B shirt. Uh, don't eat spaghetti, though, with it. That's the main problem with that fella. Uh, next up, we have this guy, which will be uh, what we're looking at, 1998, 99. Um, don't like the logo. And again, the logos could be the most charitable things in the world, like uh, arraysehunger.com or um, you know cancer.com. But if it looks wank, I'm sorry. I'm going to be cruel to be uh, kind here. But this, that looks pretty grim. Um, yeah. Is it? Is it? Is is the logo? It's pretty much similar, though, right? It is pretty similar. I don't know. The logo just looks grim. I'm gonna. It is the same shirt, though. Pretty much the same shirt. I can't be that cruel. I'm gonna. Have, I'm, I know it's bizarre. It is so bizarre that I'm that the, the you know there's such a difference in quality because of the logo. Uh, next up we have this one, Evening Post. Uh, this is old school retro, I'm loving it. Uh, this one was of course in the 1997, 98, also 96, 97 season. So they wore this for a couple of seasons, old school badge as well. Evening Post, I like the look of this one. Uh, and I'm gonna be, break the break the middle here, stick that into C, it could be better than that. It's got a nice retro feel for it. So we're gonna, we're gonna do that. Next up we have this one. Um, again, got the old retro vibe golf down the middle, night four ninety five. This badger, um, it's good, but I think the next one's better. Uh, so we're gonna, we're going to be putting this into C. It's not much. Like, I don't think it, when I see that, I don't think a Swansea. I don't think, oh, you know, that's a Swansea shirt, but I, I do like it. Certain logos that just, you know, do wonders for shirts. Now there we go. Here we go. So another golf. Sponsor shirts. This is ninety four ninety five. This was, of course, the best football. This was the best year of football ever. Uh, if you don't know why, Google it. Um, it's good. It's similar to the, the previous. Um, a little. I don't know if it's uh, the picture or I don't like the waviness about it. So I'm gonna be gonna be cruel on this one a little bit and push him down into D. Still an okay shirt though. Uh, here we go. Bit bit of ahead of its time. Back in ninety three ninety four. This one golf logo. Um, it's got, um, it's got, uh, I don't know, some sort of pat, pattern in the background. It's very, it's very ahead of its time. I'm, I'm pushing, pushing for a B here, pushing for a B. Let's do it, golf. Get up there. 
Uh, and then, of course, they actually did that the season prior without a sponsor, I believe. Um, but I'm going to put them in C. I think the lack of sponsor. Also, I think the, the manufacturer, the different logo or something, something's not right with this one. Again, that's when football began back in 92, 93. Uh, it's in more modern times. In fact, is this the, the new one, the brand new one? Um, it is. It is a brand new one. Down the middle, central, centrally located. Not a biggest fan of that. Uh, Ravia Coffee, I'm sure I'd love that. And the arms are okay. So it's good. Um, I just don't know. The logo just needed to be onto the left or the right. I don't care. I'm going to put it in to B, though. I think I think that's an okay shirt. It's pretty good. We haven't got an A yet. Uh, we're not going to get one with this one because I think this one looks pants. Um, boring. Boring West Acres snore fest. I could, you're just making me fall asleep just what, looking at that shirt. There is nothing really good about the collars out off. Uh, I'm putting that as an if. That's that's, that's boring. It's so boring. Sorry. You, you, I, know, I, I think I fell asleep. I just look at that shirt. However, I'm not, no disrespect to Swansea. This one, though, is pretty much better. I don't know why. I, I, I like the, the collar. It's good. I think it looks classy. I think we yeah, might even have an A here. Swansea University bigging up the local uh, local uh, school there. Again, charity is, is, is all good. And, but this, this logo is done nicely. It's discreet, but um, it, it, lovely colors. Keeping you just with, with the picture of the, with the, the color of the shirt. Great. It's also going to be Welsh there. This one's an A for me. Banging shirt. Potential even best shirt they've ever had. Uh, next up, we have similar, um, but a little bit too crazy down the bottom there. Um, older or, or more traditional logo, I think, for the for current, current times. Very similar to the previous, but it's not as good. I'm gonna I'm gonna go again. Crazy the stuff at the bottom. I'm not a fan of. If I'm honest with you. Ooh, ooh, this one. This one's got something about it. I like this shirt. This this pops at me. What year are we talking about? 2019, 2020. 2019, 2020. Let's have a little look. I think that must be a Premier League shirt, right? Surely? No, nope. championship shirt. I like this. I'll buy this myself. I think that looks class. That's an A. No problems. The you bet. I know people are digging the, the, the gambling stuff and I, fair fair enough but that logo is sick man uh, this one looks pretty shit the, the logo the logo very similar kind of shirt kind of feel but the bet uk just looks meh just looks like uh looks a bit tacky uh, again if the logo was a bit more bit, bit better presented then we're talking a b candidate shirt here but i'm i'm gonna go gonna be cruel a little bit and go you think i'm gonna go see um I'm going to go D. That's right. Whoa, yes. I'm crazy like that. This one, though, again, get, get a bit more simplistic with the design. Joma, the logo, the, the sponsor looks good, looks clean. Um, it's not it's it's not a winner winner. It's a B, though. It's definitely a B for me. Oh, another one, another bet company here from Swansea. Very, very white. Just, you know... It's clean. It's clean. What year we have here? It's 2017, 2008. No, 2016, 2017. Um, I like it. I like it. That's an A. It's another A. It's a good shirt. Another one. Bit of gold in this one. Quite actually, quite a lot of gold dot, dotting around. Uh, we're looking at uh, 2015, 2016. Premier League shirt, yeah, it does look like Premier League quality. Not not the best fan of these things on the arms here. The the gold, the gold batches on there, but the gold on all, all over the place looks nice. But just go the whole way round. Why just have a little chunk of gold? And the white is a little off, a little off white. Uh, I'm going to put this in the C bracket here. This one is similar. Um, the same sponsor, all white. B, it's a B for me. Better, no distracting gold chunks. Uh, what's this one here? This is again uh, what we're looking at here: 2013, 2014. Is that Premier League shirt? It is. Again, not too, too, too. It looks like a Fulham shirt. If I'm honest, would be a Fulham. A big black chunk across the middle. I'm not. It's just. It's. Just, you get rid of it. You know, keep the black stripes down the sides, but just the. the Across the middle, make up your mind. Make up your mind. It just seems like you're you're undecided about it. I, I'm putting that in the 
I like the Chinese writing or the, you know, the writing across that looks pretty good. This one, this one has got something about it. It is simple. It's a simple, again, maybe a special year. I don't know. I'm not a Swansea expert, but the badge is good. Gold everywhere. No black, but just it, uh, it's good. It's, um, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, it just the gold could be a bit more bold. You know what I mean? It doesn't pop out. It could be the bad image. But that's a B. It's a B for me on that one. Is this one though? This one, this one, this one zings a little bit because they have got the logo popping in a red. The black trim all over the place is nice, tight, discreet. Um, I like it. It's an A. It's an A for me. Another A shirt. Swansea. Hitting out of the park here. Uh, this one, not great. It is a lot of white going on here. But you can't even see the shirt. Um, yeah, this is naff. Naff. I think it's too sh too too white. <laughs> it's just, yeah, let's get, get rid of them. Yeah, bloody rare. an F. This one, again, got the, uh, I don't know, just different vibes. It doesn't, doesn't scream out to me Swansea. And the stuff down the, down the chest there, uh, it looks just dirty. It looks like you haven't washed the shirt. I'm going to put that in the trash as well. F. You're going in the F, buddy. It's harsh. Now we're talking, getting to another zinger of a shirt. What year is this? This is 2008, 2009. What year are we talking on that one? Championship. It's, yeah. I like the Swansea.com logo. The black is, is nicely distributed across the, the trim. I don't know about a winner, but I put it in the, I put it in the B's. That's a B shirt. Similar, Swansea.com back again. Don't like the arms though. Don't like the in fact. I don't like a lot of it. Don't like a lot of it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, ugh, I'm gonna put that in the F also. You might have some company though. The next one could be also an F. What is going on here? Yeah, trash. Don't know what year that is. That is. What year is that? 2006, 2007? Yeah, that looks ugly. That's butters. But ugly, that one. Sorry, whoever designed that one. Shocking. S any better? Is it any better? The pre It's a little cleaner. It's a little cleaner. In fact, is it the same fucking shirt? It's a little different. It's a little different. Still, I'm putting them in the Ds. We could do with a more, couple more Ds. Um, here we go. No, back to back to winning ways. I think this one's a, a very good shirt. Uh, strong black line across the arms, down the sides. Remax pops out with the red. Again, it's it's a nice. I think that's a that's a candidate as well. I, I whacked that up there. Uh, we're getting into the final batches here now, boys. Final batches. This one, pretty poopy. Yeah, it's grim. It's an F. Another shit shirt. Shit shirt by Swansea. I do like the thing on the collar. So that gives them a bit of something. Um, what about this one? What about this one? Simple. Uh, better than the last. It's just a bit weak. It's a weak shirt. Don't know what year that is. That is... 02, 03. I think this next one was worn a couple seasons. Um, it's from the year 2000, 2002. It's red. It's a lot of red zinging around. Stretchout.co.uk. It's cute. I like the uh, like the thing on the on the collar with the little Welsh dragon. This one's good. Uh, I'm even. I'm, I'm close to putting it in the A. I put that in the A. You wore it for a couple seasons. No wonder. That is uh, the Swansea batches uh, for for the tier ranked, whatever you want to call this. Thing. But if I have to pick a shirt, it, I, I'm I'm going this one. It's 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 a banger from from tip to top. That is just a perfect looking shirt. But that is just my opinion. Let me know your thoughts and opinions about the Swansea tier list. Here we're doing them all all of the championship clubs. I think we're trying to do all League One and maybe even all League Two from uh, now to uh, the start of football. Nine nine two nine nine three. Let me know your thoughts. Anyways, and if we get some loving on here, we might come back and do the away shirts. But until then, subscribe, thumbs up. Of course. Check it all out.
There you have it, folks. There you bloody have it. That's my personal opinion of, of course, this club's uh, shirt history. Are we going to rank them from hit to shit? Do you agree or do you disagree? Let me know your personal opinions down below. And, of course, uh, I appreciate any feedback, any comments, of course. We tried to make sure we covered each and every shirt. There might have been one or two that might slip through the cracks. But, of course, we're tomorrow we're going to do another one. Uh, so make sure you check it out. And, of course, give some love to the channel as well. Subscribe, thumbs up, and, of course, hit the little bell. But until then, guys and girls, I'm going to be bouncing out, and I'll see you soon for the next one.